am filming this intro at the end of the day. I'm off the water now. You can see the truck behind me there. Um, weird day. Uh, forgot the cord for the camera. So couldn't film for the morning. So I just kind of spent it scanning. Thank goodness for my amazing, loving wife. Uh, she drove all the way out here, brought me the cord and some other camera stuff I forgot so I could film today. Um, I don't know what I'd do without her. I'd be in a ditch somewhere, so thank goodness. Um, I'm lucky enough to be married to her, but anyways, um, today, day before a tournament, um, so the goal is to kind of just go out there and see what we see. I think I know the area I'm going to focus on, but I wanted to try and find some backup fish, um, something that if my plan to hero goes awry, which it usually does, um, then I don't have to zero. So um, we'll see. Um, found some decent fish that'll at least get me a, a limit, hopefully. So that's something, something to bank on anyways. Um, so, you know, fingers crossed, got the club tournament tomorrow uh, for July. I'm sitting in third right now and a few pounds back from uh, the leaders, so we'll see what happens. Uh, Clarksville's been fishing tough, so kind of be, gonna be interesting. It's hot, water's hot, fish are hot, I'm hot, everything's hot. Um, yeah, so a couple more months of this, but anyways. Um, sorry for the out of sequence intro, but here's the rest of the video. Wow. Quit. He pooped all over me too. Freaking jerk. Good one, but we'll take him. I knew that was going to happen. Quit. Oh. A large mouth. Was a little guy. He ain't the size we're after, but you know, he's where he's supposed to be. 
And some of you might have seen that I finally got over that thousand subscriber hump the other day. Um, that was huge. I was really kind of uh, pushing for that and working hard for that. So I'm glad it finally um, happened. And it's funny that I say finally because my goal was to have that done in the first year. Um, kind of when I set off, started to do this back in February, um, I was hopeful that in a year I'd be able to get monetized but thanks to y'all I was able to do that in about five months um, just a little over five months so thank you um, you know it's been it's been great all of the all the feedback and comments messages likes and just time spent watching me um, do what I love you know um, I try not to get too you know sappy and broken record and everything but you know this is this is what I love to do um, I hope to do this for a living one day and um, you know this is part of that journey um, so I'm glad to have you guys along for the ride um, I'm excited to bring you more footage and different points of view and um, just kind of all my adventures and whatnot so um, it's been, been really cool uh, I can't I can't say enough good things about this whole process it's a lot of work I spend a lot of time when I'm not at work pretty much when I'm home I'm either editing uh, or fishing uh, or you know something like that um, so I'm thankful for those who put up with me in this crazy schedule I run and uh, again thank you to my wife Caitlin I mean she puts up with more than probably most women should have to but um, she loves me and she supports me and she pushes me to do this um, so you know I I wouldn't be here without her so um, <laughs> thank her for all of this too you may have also seen uh, from some recent posts that I'm partnering now with Haddon Outdoors um, so see the new hat you'll see this hat and probably a shirt tomorrow um, but DJ over there has um, you know reached out and wanted to work with me on these videos and if you're familiar with Clark's Hill you've probably met um, heard of or talked to DJ Haddon so um, super thankful that I'm able to uh, be working with him and Haddon Outdoors they're a great place to be um, when you're on Clark's Hill whether it's a day on the lake with family and friends or you're fishing a, a bass tournament stop in there they've got everything you need snacks drinks ice and of course all the best fishing tackle for Clark's Hill um, you know if it works on Clark's Hill he's got it there so it's a pretty sweet shop um, I took some footage of it uh, this morning um, so here's some of that
lot more footage on that to come. So um, thanks again to DJ, and uh, we'll see we'll see where we go from here. So onwards and upwards. Five like him tomorrow. solid but a keeper anyways. It just came up, he looks like a little boy. Zach Ramsey. Zach Ramsey. Yep. He posts YouTube videos. 
I do, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's why I was talking to myself over here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I watch you sometimes. Oh, cool. I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you know uh, Josh Rockefeller, I think he put yeah. some of his stuff in there. Yeah, we were uh, college fishing partners. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay, he fished high school with my son. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah keep it up, though. I like, I like watching. I appreciate it. It means a lot. Well, always cool to meet somebody uh, who watches the videos. Um, if you guys do ever see me out on the water, or at the store, or on the ramp, or whatever, just come say hey. It's great to meet y'all and talk to y'all. Um, hopefully, you're you're enjoying the videos. Found some fish today. Um, I think I know what I want to do tomorrow. Um, we'll see. I'm gonna go back to the shop, get rigged up, and uh, go home, get some rest, rehydrate see what happens tomorrow um, got to have a few guys missing so it's gonna be a small crowd tomorrow but it'll be fun nonetheless so anyways appreciate you guys uh, tuning in and watching uh, it really does mean a lot to uh, to me and thank you all for tuning in and I'll see you at the next one